If what you say is true, then I'm sure Ken has a very good reason for not telling me. Well, I'd like to hear why. I'd like an explanation. I'd also like you to verify what he told me last night. Verify what? That you've begun menopause. What? Why did you tell... Why did you say that to her? I told her uh, out of my own frustration and, and the concern and the helplessness that I was feeling about the whole thing. But you're the one that suggested the... the I, I mean, I, I, I haven't... Uh, uh, did, did I say something about it? Sweetheart, last night, that's what triggered the whole thing. Don't you remember that? You were sitting there describing the symptoms that you were having, the hot flashes, the headaches, dizziness, short, shortness of breath, and then you started crying, and, and you got depressed. The whole thing escalated. I didn't know what to do. I don't remember any of that. Maybe it didn't happen. It happened. I'm just sorry I told you. I should have talked to Sophia about it later when she was in a better state of mind. I have nothing to hide, so why don't you go ahead and finish your little private talk? Mom. Mom, I'm not coming down on you. I am concerned about Ken. I want to make sure that you see him clearly for the man that I think he is. He has not been married just once. He's been married twice. Both of those women have died. Now, I don't know what that means. It just makes me feel very uneasy about the situation. Can you understand that? All right, now you listen to me. You and the whole family have been making these ugly, nasty accusations about Ken for a long time, and I know where it started. It's probably started with your father, no, no. but I don't want no. to hear any more about it from you. That is not fair. I'm Kelly, not trying to hurt you. I it's... want you to apologize to him. I'm not going to apologize for something that I think you need to hear. I think you also have to get the answers to some very important questions. One of which is, why was Ken at Andy's the night that you fell and hit your head? He didn't tell you about that, did he? Mom. How am I supposed to feel about this? You're taking these weird pills. I find you drinking all the time. Your, your, your behavior is strange. You're not the mom that I know. Kelly, I am not taking pills anymore at all. I'm on no medication. I'm not taking... And I, I, I got drunk on champagne last night. So what? So what's the crime? I'm just fighting a losing battle here, aren't I? Because I can tell you what I feel till I'm blue in the face. I can't make you do anything about it. All I can do is express to you what I feel to be the truth. What you do with that... It, is your business. I don't want to argue with you. I don't want to fight with you. I don't want to be angry with you. I don't want you to be angry with me. And I want you to know that I'm just fine. I really am. I love you. Just be careful, okay? Remember, you can call me any time of the day or night. All right? All right. Why didn't you tell me you were married twice? 